Dizzy, how has your experience been seeing cricket season line up with NAIDOC week for the first time? I, I think it's been fantastic. I think it is part of our uh, history as a country. Um, you know, part of it. You know, my, my culture as, a, as an individual, I suppose, but as you know, it is part of you know who we are. And uh, you know, I think it's fantastic that uh, Cricket Australia um, you know, has you know has made a real effort to celebrate NAIDOC Week. You know, it is part of who we are. What was the experience like for you to read the Barefoot Circle commitment statement before the game started on Sunday? Yeah, that was pretty cool. Um, yeah, that was a real honour for me and, uh, you know, very thankful for that opportunity and, uh, yeah, it, it meant a lot. Yeah, it was great. Can you tell us why it's important for the players to sort of embrace NAIDOC week? Yeah, um, I, I think as much as anything, um, you know, I think there's probably a lot of players who probably don't know a lot about it. So, you know, for me, it, it comes down to it's... it's it's a good way to educate players who, who may not know a lot about um, Indigenous culture and not, not know much about NAIDOC wheat. So I think that education uh, for players, and you know, I've certainly been asked a, you know, a couple of questions here and there from the boys just uh, asking about it, what's it about. So it's been, it's been great from, from that perspective for sure. Would you like to see something like this, as in celebrating Indigenous culture over a week or around? Uh, perhaps incorporate into the BBL and, and next season? Oh, 100%. Yeah, and, uh, you know, we, we've had um, the Indigenous uh, shirts, haven't we, for, you know, around in, in Big Bash, and which was fantastic. And, I mean, I'd love to see them all the time. They're great. Um, but, yeah, certainly to incorporate that, I think it'd be fantastic in BBL. Callum Ferguson, can you describe him as a person and as a player and his impact on Australian and South Australian cricket? Well, look, all we've seen since he's uh, announced his retirement, just there's been so much great narrative about Callum, the person. You know, obviously we know his playing career uh, has been special, fantastic. One of the greatest players South Australia has produced, uh, without question, uh, has represented our country with pride and, uh, and done very well. Um, but I think all the narrative has been just what a fine bloke he is, uh, what a great person he is. He's been a great teammate, great friend, um, you know, to so many, uh, over so many years. And, and look, he'll go down as one of South Australia's greatest players, but he'll also go down as one of South Australia's greatest blokes. And uh, no, he's, he's a credit to himself, he's a credit to his family, he's a credit to South Australia and Australian cricket. And uh, look, it's it's sad to see, see a player uh, finish up, but he can be, uh, you know, very happy with with the career he's had, um, you know, for for South Australia uh, and Australia, you know, he, he gave everything, and uh, look, he quite rightly uh, should be counted as, as one of the true greats of South Australian cricket, and uh, it's um, yeah, he's a fantastic guy.